a beautiful example of a 1989 Lamborghini Countach. This, the 25th anniversary model. Instantly recognizable as a Lamborghini. And a lot of these style cues were carried over by other manufacturers from the late 80s into the 1990s. A very different profile to anything that Ferrari and Pininfarina have been doing for decades with their rounded, curvaceous designs. So is this design any better or any worse? No, I think they both work equally well. The car produces a very slippery shape, which gets it through the air very fast. And it also produces downforce from the rear wing at the back. That pushes the car into the road or onto the track. And when you're driving a Lamborghini with so much power, well, you need all the help you can get.